What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Forza Horizon 5 here in the winter season or storm season in uh, series number four. So today driving around in our BMW M2 that we unlocked in the last video by doing the seasonal playground games. If you haven't seen that definitely go check it out. Um, but today we're going to jump in and finish out the festival playlist and we're going to start off with the weekly Forzathon challenge. So let's see what we got to do. So we've already step, or completed step one, and that was just to own and drive any American or German car made before 2010. I think we did that um, in our Porsche when we played the trial event. Um, so our next step is to win a cross-country event, cross-country circuit event, very clear, circuit event, um, with that car um with the american or german car made before 2010 so i'm gonna go jump into something a little more suiting for cross country and we'll get this one started all right i think this is a fitting car the porsche desert flyer um i'm not sure what tunes on here it was already a class so um we're just gonna leave it at that so now we just need to find a cross country circuit event um, I'm assuming that I've done all of the circuit events. Make sure there's none that are new. So, yeah. We're just going to jump into this one. It's quick and easy. Um, airfield cross country circuit. And then I'm just going to create a new event. Um, we're going to do event settings. We just need one lap. And we're going to do s morning. We're going to do clear. Um, that looks good to me, and I think we'll be good to go. Oh, we want to publish it. That's what we want to do. If you do want to use mine uh, that I just created, uh, the share code is on screen now, 507-071-801. Um, this should just be an easy one. I mean, you could do this in really any kind of car, um, just because this um, event is not like an actual cross-country event it's very mild might as well be a dirt race but we'll see what this dirt racer can do i've got it set to one lap so obviously you've got to get up in the first pretty quick um hopefully that won't be an issue here maybe i shouldn't have put it to rally or rally monsters and just put it to open class because these things are uh could all be relatively quick. Um, so we'll see. We may have to change that up here in a second if this doesn't work out. Barely got that checkpoint. I don't know. I've, got, I've had so many cars do that on that jump. Maybe it was this car that did it last. I don't remember. <laughs> Up into third. We should be able to get those last two positions around one of these other turns. I'm just cutting short here. Let off the gas and get back on it. Beautiful. So up into first. We just have to make sure that we hold that until the finish line. I don't think should be an issue. We're just going to hit the brakes a little there just to get a little slide around there. And then we are going to get across the line. So there is a first place finish. Hopefully that that counts. It should. I mean, we're in a Porsche and we just did a cross country circuit. So, and we won. So that should all count and be fine and dandy. Uh, we'll find out as we get back here into the world. Come on, give us the prompt. All right, face the competition complete, perfect. So now we need to earn three stars on any trailblazer in our pre-2010 American or German car. So let's see, let's find us a trailblazer now. I'm not a big fan of trailblazers just because they are basically cross country things. Um, so this one we may be able to do. We'll try this one. Ooh, that Ford Hoonigan would be a really good option for that. Um, Cause that should count, but we're gonna try with this thing and see if we can do it here. 
I don't know why it spawns you sideways Turn on the around. track sometimes. So what I usually do for these trailblazers is I try to put a waypoint where it is, um, just so I know, or where the finish line is, just so I know a general direction of which way I should be going once I hit the, uh, the, what's it called here? The start line. Turn around when it is safe to do so. So let's see, we're going to try to hit it. And get there, we need to do it uh, with 15, yeah, with 15 seconds left on the counter. So we'll see. Route. I don't know if we'll be able to do it in this A-class car. Um, like I said, we're just kind of testing. Okay, yeah, we got it. Even with a little bit of a rollover. Crush it. And that should get that next step completed. Go, 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 complete. As it did. And now we just need to earn five crash landing combos. So essentially what that is, it's just you get an air skill and a wreckage skill around the same time. So, um... Basically, we're just going to kind of just drive through and see if we can't get it. There was one. Great wreckage, ultimate air, ultimate air. Another crash landing. So basically, basically you just drive around and uh, destroy stuff, you know? The, the really, the basis of Forza Horizon, right? Just, there's another one we should be at least maybe one off because it was only five there we go so that is the really forza on challenge completed um so now we are going to jump in and do the photo challenge as well as the two-wheeler challenger uh collectible challenge so this one both of these are going to be really easy um, for this one, we just need the 2017 Ferrari 812 super fast, and we need to take a picture of it on the Horizon Mexico circuit. And then for this one, we just need to smash 20, 10 bicycles. So we'll start out with this one, just because I know an easy way to do this. Um, if we go to the map and then go up here to Guanajuato, um, there's a little park right here. So if we fast travel over here, there is a little section that has some... <clears throat> bikes inside the park and there should be more than enough for us to wreck through let me see if I can find it I don't remember exactly where it was inside here maybe on the other side Are they not here at night? Oh, there, there's some. Okay, so there's some here. And then there's some more up there. You see them? So, you should be able to just to... Uh... And then, there you go. Two-way challenger complete. They line them up real easy for you there. Um, so there's that one done. Um, that actually gets us enough points for both of our seasonal objectives. And we are two points off of the saline, so the photo challenge will actually get us to the saline, which is pretty sweet. So we'll jump over here, or jump over to the Mexico, or the Horizon Mexico circuit. Um, if you don't know where that is, oh, if I hit the right button, that is the circuit that is at the main Horizon festival here. So I'm going to jump over here and jump into that super fast. Alright, so if you don't have the super fast... Um, you can go and I mean you can get it from wheel spins or the auto show you might be able to buy it on the auction house for a little cheaper but through the auto show it is 350,000 credits just as a heads up so just over here at the circuit all you should have to do is uh, take a picture doesn't even have to look good so um, we'll get that and both of those check marks to get that applause horn as well so we back out of here and go into our start menu. We can claim both the Wuling Sunshine, the Remek Concept 2, and the Saline S7. 
I already had two of the, er, I already had one of the Saline S7s. I swear they give us cars that we already had. I don't know how I got it. I'm assuming through a wheel spin. But nonetheless, if you don't have it, it's a good way to get it. Um, but that is the rest of the festival playlist outside of the Horizon Open and a few of the daily Forzathon challenges. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video or found it helpful. Um, if you are struggling with any of the other seasonal challenges for this week, definitely go check out my other videos um, that I posted on Thursday. I don't know when this one will go up per se, since this is the last one, it may go up on Friday morning. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the video or found it helpful. If you did, definitely leave a like on the video. Definitely get subscribed for future Forza Horizon 5 content just like this. But other than that, I do hope you have a great rest of the day and we will see you in the next one.